You know, I don't own a TV. I have no attachment to the mainstream media whatsoever. Whatever information that I get, I get directly from stuff like all of the news hubs, the actual news hubs that all the other news outlets get. But those news hubs include real stories, real news pieces. So tonight I took the opportunity. That, that, that's the way you, you say it when you're trying to be politically correct and polite. I took the opportunity to go look around the uh, mainstream media news. And finally it dawned on me, this is why Americans are stupid. There is no business section. There is no real politics information. So I went to like the stuff that should be real news, right? And, it, and, and instead of their, they reporting real news, they're reporting stuff like Hillary laughed at a joke. The KKK were arrested. Uh, Donald Trump's uh, grandfather uh, w was formally caught at a, a Klan rally. Th that's not politics. That is not politics. That's what we call yellow journalism. Which means it's it's rag, it's gossip, it's it's oh look ho ho woo boo sis boom pow look. That's not politics. Those aren't real news. Real news will be, after questioning, has come to the conclusion that Donald Trump is against uh, women's rights, or or he's for abortion, or something like that. Right? That's news. That's a specific issue, actual question. Actual answer stated in a factual manner, not, oh, oh, look, Donald Trump, uh, his hair isn't real or his hair is real or such and so insulted such and so. And so this is surrounding the Os Oscars. Every possible way they could include the Oscars. Uh, there's a whole bunch of people who do not watch the Oscars, but they want to cram it down your throat so much. Let's let me look at the sports. Oscars, finance, Oscars, autos, Oscar, celebrity, Oscar, shopping, Oscar, movies, Oscars, politics, Oscars, beauty, Oscars, style, Oscar, tech, Oscar, TV, Oscar, all of it. Do you think you're actually going to get something different? This is why America's stupid. Your news doesn't report actual news. No, nothing adult about it. Nothing mature about it. Let's have a mature look at the news. Let's let's have a real news story. Let's see what Congress is doing, setting about some policy. No, we get, oh, uh, uh, Bernie Sanders fell down. Who cares if Bernie Sanders, who cares if uh, Reed fell down? Who, who cares? That's not news. This is why America is stupid. You're not even getting anybody trying to, t to uh, tell you anything newsworthy. When TMZ is breaking stories and other news outlets are carrying TMZ stories, that's not news. TMZ is trash, utter trash. And any outlet that will carry a TMZ story is trash. You heard it here, folks. It's trash. If you see something and it has something about TMZ or the National Enquirer, oh, the National Enquirer broke this story, trash. You would contact the advertisers of that station and say, this station is reporting trash. I will not buy anything that you support on this station until you make them change. That's how you do it. You hit them exactly where they need to be hit. You've been quiet way too long. You've been complacent way too long. This is how you do it. Same thing for black people. You want to get black people being portrayed as idiots and criminals 100% of the time on the news? You call the advertiser and say, get this trash off of the TV. Otherwise, we, the black people who consume everything, who buy everything, who can't even hold on to a dollar, will not buy your stuff. We will boycott your, your company. If you don't make the news, stop that. Do I have to come out and tell you this is how you, how you do uh, conduct things? What have I said before? You don't have to cry racism all the time. All you need to do stuff as adults, as an adult. You don't go crying in the street. Oh, my baby, they shot my baby. You go and say, we are going to pull everybody from City Hall. You will not have a seat next, next, next month if you don't get these police in check. That's how you do it. You don't run to the police. Who are the police? They're dogs. They're, no they're nothing. They're absolutely nothing. They have no authority and no power. They're literal dogs. 
They're literal thugs. They're literal rogues and they have no power. And you're crying about the police? Do I have to tell you this stuff? I have to because the news is, is, is treating you like babies. The Oscars on every subject of the news, every topic of the news, the Oscars, that's not news. Politics is now gossiped. That's not news. No wonder you're stupid. No wonder you're ignorant. No wonder we have the KKK still running around in 2016. You don't know how to shut stuff down. And you're complacent, black and white people. You're all complacent. I was offended when I was watching, when I did a long time ago when I was watching CNN, and they literally broke in to give a gossip story. I was like, what is this? I was offended. Now, that is commonplace. Now, that is the order of the day. The gossip is the news now. I don't know who gave that order, but they completely switched their programming. At least before we were arguing, that, well, that wasn't factual. They lied to you. Fox News is lying. Then it was found out CNN is lying. Then it was found out MSNBC is lying. NBC is lying. Everybody's lying. They said, okay, we won't even lie. The news pieces that you get now are going to be all gossip. You will never, ever get news any, any, any longer. Ever. This is why Americans are stupid. You hate Miley Cyrus. Now she's all over the place. Because you don't have the balls to pick up your damn phone and go, hey, Tide. Yeah, stop supporting Miley Cyrus. Get that off of the show. Or else we will no longer buy Tide. And you cannot not afford to lose us as a customer. Because I'll tell every single person not to buy Tide or any Procter & Gamble stuff. Period. I know how the system works here. All of you. You don't want your little girls turning to, to slut whores? This is what you do. This is what you do. It was the running rumor in the black community that black people didn't, that the white people didn't put up with stuff. They would simply call, call somebody else and get stuff done. But no more because now everybody's stupid. Everybody's stupid. And you insult Christians to the, to the point where Christians just shut up and go about their own business. And when you shut up, they think they have won. Although now you're 75% of the country. You are the overwhelming majority. None of the stuff that's anti-Christian should be on TV at all. But you all shut up and go about your business. Because you want to play nicey-nicey with the people who are attacking you. You're at war and you don't even know it. They're trying to destroy your church and you don't even know it. The country's founded on the freedom of religion. But you are acquiescing to people attacking you left and right. Even the government. Even the government telling you that you have to do this, this and that in your business, which the Constitution never applied to private citizens. It applies only to the government. That's what the Constitution is for. And any idiot coming up to you and says, well, well, you run a public business. So, no, it's not a public business. It's a private business. And you're such an idiot. You don't, you don't even know it. It's a private business. Started by, by a private person. Well, you, you, you're a public business, so you have to uh, give me my constitutional rights. No, false. That's completely a lie. A private citizen can completely deny you freedom of speech. A private citizen completely deny you everything. Because the constitution doesn't apply to private citizens. It doesn't apply to private businesses. In fact, most of the constitution applies only to the federal government. And literally it says... Everything else is saved for the states. And then you have to go to the state and all, even the state constitution applies only to the state government and the city government. It doesn't apply to private citizens. That's why all of this stuff about marriage and stuff and you have to do this and you have to take pictures and you have to, that's all a lie. You don't never apply to private citizens. You're under attack and you don't even know it. Political correctness doesn't apply to private people. Never did. You don't have to obey that stuff at all. Well, you won't get customers. Yes, you will. 75% of the country is friggin' Christian. Yes, you will get what are the what happened with the people who were who were simply asked a question and they answered it unpolitically correct? And they tried to shut down their pizza store. Within a day they made millions in a GoFundMe uh, campaign. Millions in a day. You all don't understand the power that you have. 
you have been beat into complacency so much that you don't even know right from wrong. But but I've come I've had an epiphany. This is why America's stupid. The news tr- treats you like an idiot and gives you idiotic crap, idiotic stories. And don't think they're finished with you. They're not they this is just the beginning. I don't want to go into it, but this is just the beginning. The stuff coming down the pipeline is so heinous, so egregious, so disgusting that you better get off of your butt and pick up that phone and tell the tell the advertisers, we are not going to buy your product if you support this. Get this news story off the air. Yes, that's that's how you that's how you exercise your real rights. People are talking about the Illuminati. They're talking about the NWO and all that sort of stuff. And people just go along with it. Oh, well, you know what? It's it's their Hollywood. No, it's not their Hollywood. It's your Hollywood. You're the one that buys the tickets. If you say, get this get this Illuminati crap off of the damn movie, off of the damn TV show, off of the commercial, get it off, get it out of my Super Bowl. I don't want to see it. It would be gone tomorrow. It would be gone tomorrow. But you sit, sit there complacent. You best believe if anything ever ticks me off, I call whomever. I have them stuttering on the phone. Uh, 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 sir, sir. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want to hear it. Stop it. I don't want you voting on that. What, what sir? I, I have fans. I'm not just an average person. I don't just have 10 friends and their 10 friends and their 10 friends. No, I have thousands of people who listen to me. And I'm not talking about YouTube. Because I just checked out my YouTube steps and the people who suppose they're subscribed to me don't even impact my numbers at all, at all. Not even, not even halfway. You want to continue being stupid? Be stupid. You've been warned. You've been awakened by me. You have zero excuses of to uh, let this stuff continue. And even the per- the people who are quote unquote benefiting from this stuff are not benefiting from this stuff. That's what's really sad about it. All the women stuff. Oh, oh, girl power. But, but yeah, you're destroyed. You're utterly destroyed. Coming and going, you're destroyed by your own hands. Oh yeah, girl power. Oh yeah, look, we're doing this for women. No, you're not doing that for women. You're doing that against women. Women are human beings, and this is against human beings. So you're not doing it for women. You're not doing it for children. You're not doing it for anybody. You're destroying humanity. And what vestige of humanity is left in the world? is disappearing at a rapid pace. And it's time for the people with some actual morals to speak up. I'm sorry, atheist is not the majority. Even women's lib is not the majority. Not, not even close. I know you hear about them all the time because you sat on your butt and just let them take over the airwaves. That's what happens. This is what my channel is, is, was created to combat, to wage war against. All this stupidity. All of this stuff that's, oh, 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 look, you got to do this because there's so many of us. That's a perception. There's so many of us. There's not. What does normal mean? Normal means 50% of the people are doing it. That's what the word normal means. What's normal in the, in the United States? Heterosexual Christian. Heterosexual Christian. Who? Oh, oh, I'm about to tell you something that's going to blow your mind. Ready? I said 50%, right? Heterosexual Christian married Christian. How many of you all, your head just exploded? Because you don't hear that on the news. You hear all of these fringe people, fringe, 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 fringe. So every woman is a, a woman's lib type of woman, a third wave feminist. No. They're like 10 to 15% of the population. Heterosexual married Christian. That goes for black too. <gasps> oh. Bet your head really exploded at that one, huh? What did I say? 50%. That goes for Hispanic. That goes for Asian, Jewish, heterosexual, married Christian. You don't hear this. They don't want to, they don't want to show these numbers. They want you to live in a cave and think that you are not the majority. You are the majority. What do I keep telling you? I cater to the majority on my channel. Who's the majority on my channel? Heterosexual married men. Overwhelmingly. I have like 15 different statistics that all crawl, crawl all over my videos. Oh yeah. Yeah. Send those robots, send the robots in and they get all of your information. And then I bring it up. Heterosexual 
married men with a little bit of money. That's who watches me. I, I try to get more women, but women don't like me. As, as soon as I mention the word woman, they run away. It's okay, though. You don't matter. Seriously, you don't. Do I have any animosity against women? No, absolutely not. I love women. I love all women. Old, young. Well, not, not too young now. I'm not, I'm not crazy. <laughs> White, blue, green, gray. I love you all. I'm not going to marry you all, but I, I love you all. I have that open love for, ever, uh, for all human beings, period. I don't know why. I, I can only assume that there just are not that many women on the internet. And from the data that I see, that as much as women want to pretend and I so, oh, look, we have all these women's websites. Yes. So you have literally captured all the women on the internet on your website. But all these other websites have no women on them. None. Thousands and thousands, millions of subscribers. No women. So I can only assume that my channel is a sort of reflection because I have not uninvited any women. Or I haven't made any anti-women thing. I, I know you think I've made some anti-women stuff, but I have not. And actually, in the United States, there is less men than women. So this whole women are a minority is, is such a laugh. It's such a joke. But they keep putting it in your face, and you believe it. Thank you for watching the Shikama Live Show. I'm, I'm sorry that Americans are stupid. But now, I have a clearer understanding why. Your news is literally for idiots. Literally. Uh, there's no like nuance to it when the politics is gossip when the political news is gossip you're an idiot they're treating you like an idiot i don't know anybody who would tolerate that who has some sort of sense and and then they wonder why oh why are people less people watching tv thank you for watching just come live show